my in the Aranya, you will be a kind of bad. The land is also for all of us, uh, for my people and for the chief. Too. The chief, too, has a land. In every society, they are bound to be conflicts between people of the land. As part of their duties, chiefs settle disputes to ensure that there is peace and harmony. Some disputes are even withdrawn from the police station to be dealt with by the chiefs. The people of Bazin community in the Lora municipality wish they were not having a chief. According to some community members, the chief is working against their interests. Without missing words, some of the community members mentioned that the chief brought in Flanny herdsmen to Bazin community and their cattle is destroying economic trees as well as their farm produce. Dogba Richard could not hold back his tears as he told Upper West PR TV that the chief of Bazin, Na Dauri Pinta Toba II, seized his farmland for the Flanny to settle without any compensation. Uh, I feel I need to know that they don't take my money. Oh, they were cool. My in a dear Ranya, Baba, he won't be a kind of bad. If we easy, you don't make the good door come up. I'm your bunker, that they are made up and come back to a quack in a delicodia flat regards. I'm a command, you are like a year, good, and yet I could. Responding to this allegation, the chief, Na Dauri Pinta Tobo II, stated that anyone who thinks he is sitting on their interest and the law should go to court. But I, I want to say honestly that anybody who thinks that um, is, in, is, is in the interest of people and the law, we should go to the court. Okay. Yes. But, but you are the chief. You are serving the people. And if the people you are serving are saying that, chief, this is what we want you to do for us, is it a bad thing? No. If, if the people are saying that and it's reasonable or agree, mm. it will not be a bad thing. Okay. All my children are outside. Mm. I don't have anybody. I'm with my wife alone. I have got cattle. The, sec the second thing is that I've not asked the flat man to come and uh, do anything. The land is also for all of us, mm. including uh, for my people and for the chief too. The chief too has a land. Okay. Have you seen? The landlord of the Bazin community, Kang Iyur Silvenus, said there will be no peace in the community until the Fulani headsmen move away. You won't be baby a young. Ke yelen pam ba wonu ma pala fla ne nya nanta esasi po kamma boni a mo bon ka ma la ka ra si ke mo bo ngwa su duoro mo bon be fla ne nya ni ta kan wo ye ka kan pier anya a fla ne nya yala to titana bebe ka te soro ku ka ta soro fla ne yala o la wane ba te ba o ni tukun ba la ka belen kun ir Setting your horn pamba, take up a swans yap here. Mine with Ibi and Enduba. See Gadama Panapella, a yellow poor. Some youth leaders in the community are also worried about the issue. So, I never know what I think I tell my lower, to my dear Mirapel. I can't never know what Zina about Padron, a knee as I never ma about him taking suit. Chetuman yet to all bring you in Yelha Pellam. Check about dear Bibidia, a dear, a dear donut. We discovered this bloody in February. And we tried to solve the issue amicably with our, our chief because we were reliably informed that he was the one who settled them there. Some of our young boys went to the, to, to the bush for some wood and confronted the Fulani who said it was Bazina who settled them. And the Bazina came into the, 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 the issue, the scene, and, and agreed that he had settled them there. Aha. Uh -huh. All those people who said he had met before settling them, we questioned all of them and they denied. They said they were not contacted before. And so we think it's an illegal way of settling uh, the police and we don't like it. So do you think the chief is hiding something from the community members? Yes, mm. I think he's hiding something. Mm. Yeah, what he is gaining from the police we don't know. And he's insisting that they must stay.
but for us we think that is an illegal way of settling the Fulanis. The chief is however willing to send the Fulani headsmen away, but on one condition, according to him, if the assemblyman and the community members can get him someone to take care of the cattle, he will send the Fulani man away. What I want you to understand is that mm. in the uh, uh, Laura municipal, municipality, mm. we have about 42 Fulani settlements around the whole uh, Laura municipal. Yeah, so it is not passing in Ado. He told me that he, I should let the Fulani man go. He will, he will see to it that some people take up uh, my, my cattle and take care of it. I'm still waiting. If he brings uh, bring those people to take the cattle today, I will send the flag man away. So I'm still waiting for the assemblyman to send me the, those who will take my cattle. There are not many. I will just, about 15, I will just give it to, to the person. The assemblyman for the area, Honorable Dozing Andrews, said he raised the issue in the assembly meeting, but he was told that a committee has been set up to sit on the case, and until the committee's report is out, nothing can be done about it. The community wrote to the Laura Parman chief, who also doubles as the climate change chairman, the Laura Municipal Assembly, and the Upper West Regional Minister Dr. Hafiz Bin Sali concerning the issue, but has not seen any positive response yet. Reporting for Upper West PR TV, my name is Idris Sudasana, Bazin Community, Upper West Region, Ghana.